Hi everybody, it's Miss Taylor here, and we're gonna go ahead and make another project from the Studio Ace Art Kit. My happy assistant is here. And what are we gonna be making, Quinlan? The butterfly. The what? The butterfly. We're gonna be making the butterfly project. So here we go. So these are the supplies that came in the Studio Ace Art Kit for making the cork butterfly. The materials are wine corks, construction paper, there should have been two colors, glue, it's a glue stick, googly eye stickers, these cute little guys here, a marker, and then the last material you'll need for this project is a pair of scissors. Hopefully you have a pair at home. Any pair will do, kid scissors, parent scissors. Okay, so step one, cut out two bigger hearts and two smaller hearts for each cork butterfly. So choose the color you want to be for the bigger heart. Go ahead and just fold it in half. I'm gonna be using a black Sharpie just so you can see my drawing a little bit easier, but use whatever color came in your kit. We're gonna be making two butterfly corks today. So we're gonna draw two different size hearts on this paper that's folded in half. So that way we can end up with four. Let's start off with a curved line and then another curved line, and then bring it down to a point. And the easiest way to draw a heart, for those of you that maybe have trouble drawing hearts, is to start off with the shape of the letter M, and then come down like the letter V. I'd like to see that again. If you start with like the letter M, and then just make the letter V, and you can get a nice heart shape that way. What do you think, Quinn? Can you do it? Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna draw another big heart on the other side here. And then we're gonna be cutting these out for the back part of the butterfly wing. Now, since we had folded that paper in half, when we go to cut out our heart, we're gonna end up with two that are exactly the same size. So I'm cutting out one set, and my happy assistant over here, who is four and a half, is cutting out his hearts. So now I have two hearts for my butterfly wings about this size. And now I need to cut two more that are about this, a little bit smaller. So I'm gonna take my other color construction paper and again, I'm gonna fold it in half. We're making two cork butterflies. Quinlan's still cutting out his. My happy assistant is still cutting out his heart. I'm gonna go ahead and make two smaller size hearts. I'm gonna start with the shape of a letter M, and then bring it down to diagonal lines like a letter V. Same thing over here. All right, and now we're gonna cut these two out. My paper was folded in half, so I'm gonna end up with four hearts. Go ahead and put those right there, sweetie. So Quinlan has his two hearts cut out. So now I have my smaller hearts glued on top of my bigger hearts. My next step is to use the glue stick on the back of the wine cork and stick the hearts to make them look like butterfly wings. So basically we're gonna line them up like this and then we're gonna glue our cork right here in the middle so it's like the body of the butterfly. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put lots of glue on my cork here. I'm going to put one wing right on the back there. I'm going to hold it down. And then I'm going to put a little bit more glue on there. I'm going to put a little bit on the paper and a little bit on the cork. I guess, sweetheart, your turn. You got to glue that one down. Okay. 
get a okay, little. Make sure you give it some time to dry before handling it too much. But there is my butterfly wings. You use your googly eye stickers that came in the kit, or you can also just draw the eyes right on the cork. So I'm gonna go ahead and take two of these stickers and put one right here. Those are monsters. Quinlan said he's gonna be turning his into a Frankenstein butterfly because he got an eyeball that is a little red and creepy looking. Did you get it on there? It, oh, honey. it needs glue. Okay, well this needs time to dry. This glue needs time to dry. So let's go ahead and leave this sit here. Okay. And then if you want, you could use your pipe cleaners and glue those on the back and then you have little antennas but these you can also use with the beads that came in your kit so it's your choice if you want to use them for your butterfly or if you'd rather keep them for your beads but that's another option of something to do with those pipe cleaners so let's see what it would look like like this right little antennas otherwise there you have your cute little cork yeah. butterfly What's the next one? <laughs> Can you say thank you for making with me? Thanks for making with me, and I even made a circle orange baby.